Haley's supposed to be filming this, but she said I should one-hand it. I should quote unquote Andy Schrock it. Okay, no, you can't film it like that. The, what do you mean? Oh, it's you just like filming your beard. <laughs> okay, what's wrong with that? Here, you take. Okay. You take. Are you filming? Yeah, I'm recording. How can you even tell you're filming? Your thing's not open. Because I know that whatever I point the lens at will be in the shot. Yeah, you're like, oh, hey guys, how's it going? Check no. out my beard. <laughs> I'm never like that. I'm on the wrong side of you. You mean you're on the wrong side of me? Oh, because I'm regular. That makes sense. Really? Come there. with me. Follow me. Here I go. Ugh. Just barely. Big boy. So we're at this abandoned putt putt course. I'm going to try to film a video part just at this one spot because it's so big and there's so many options. And I'm going to try to do it in a day. More so, actually, Cody said I have them for three to four hours, so I'm gonna try to film it in that much time. And the strategy is I'm gonna try to just film really long lines. I'm gonna have Cody, who's good at filming, make it look a lot cooler than it is. That's the plan. Kaylee, hold my camera. Document me. Since we're right here, I should try to like just start off getting something like right here. Yeah, maybe you should do that uh, wall, -y, wall ride thing. Wall ride right, thing. Uh, just ride the wall. <laughs> That's not a thing. Can you zoom in on this thing? It's really a... Uh... It's really bright. What do the kids call it? Overexposed? You gonna hit this rail? Oh, what? Look at this spot. We got this sick flat bar. I don't know what this is supposed to be. Can you do a hippie jump? I got it. I just flipped a 400 pound tire yesterday. I can do it. I don't even know if I can jump over this thing. I mean, you got height. <laughs> <laughs> that would actually be kind of cool to like actually film. This thing's like solid though, so you can't clip it. Oh, I probably won't. Oh, that is terrifying. Let me take a run at it. Yeah, yeah, you do. You show me how it's done. Nailed it. I would need shorts to do it. These shorts? Pants, these pants are restricting my jump. Yeah, okay. Oh wait, I wonder if I could use it to hoist myself up. Oh, that was kind of cool. It. <laughs> someone, like someone could definitely ollie over it. Just, I'm definitely not that somebody. Here's another pole jam thing. I'm not sure what Dan can do on it. Dan can't really skate, but. Are you getting, you getting footage of me getting footage? Yeah, so right when you come in the entrance of this putt putt course, there's this pool right here that, as you walk past it, it looks like it has like decent transition. But when you get in, it's just like, just shy of being good. You can see like, your nose scrapes on the way up. That's what all these like black marks are. And it's probably, I mean, transition ends right here. So that's like one foot of transition. And then what, what would you say? Four foot or three foot avert? vert? Probably five foot seven. Seven foot eight is what I was thinking. Seven foot eight, which is how tall I am. Getting to the coping, I feel like is most likely not happening. Let, let me try to drop in on it real quick. Maybe I can do that. Oh God. See, I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to get my four down. I already regret this. You don't have to do this. <laughs> Why would you say that? Whatever. As you can see, my nose scraped on the way out. And also, I feel like, because I was carving- It's in replay. <laughs> yeah, play it back. Also, I was carving on it earlier. Every time I rode over this, it would chip away. There's also this, this over here, which it might actually be too dark to film on, but I don't feel like adjusting it. It's kind of carving. You can kind of swerve into it, which, as you can see, if you go straight, it's really, this one's actually steeper, so there's none of that. But if you go sideways, you can kind of avoid, nah, you still scrape your nose. But you scrape your nose a lot less, so it makes it a little bit easier to ride on. Fun fact about this fence, Dale tried to go under it last time we were here, and the whole fence just fell on top of him. So I came here like three days ago with Dale, and there's this really cool bench. And me. Why are you neglecting your girlfriend? I'm not neglecting, I'm just failing to mention because you're not as relevant as Dale. Uh, we skated this bench into this bank and uh, now it's broken. So I'm gonna use my keen ramp skills to attempt to try to fix it. I filmed a line, don't touch my bench. I filmed a line here last time that Haley filmed that ended on this bench. Let me get in there. This isn't safe. You're so close to our seating hairline, stop. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. There's all kinds of spider eggs under there. Oh yeah, that's a... We gotta get out of here. We can't, this is skate stop now. It's knobbed. Yeah. It's knobbed with nature. I want this bench to be better than it was before. So the bench is, the wood is broken. It's so okay, it's, just might, yeah, snap in half. So let me do my trick first. Uh, we're just gonna run it. The run up for this thing is a nightmare. All right, so this one's still like, 
it's just too broken. That wood's gonna like yank out. So I found another one of these. I'm just gonna replace it with a new one and hopefully that works just fine. Oh, Haley's getting real clips for a part. <laughs> I'm about to win. I just need to kill one person. I have 20 seconds. Are you gonna get this on a... Uh... All right, so I replaced the old bench with the new bench. Uh, I changed the angle of it because before, when you'd, you'd come off of this right here and then you'd have to like carve out, but now I made it more cockeyed this way. I think I'm straight on. What? Jesus. Do you want me to move it back? Because we come from up here like big boys. I just come straight from the run up. What's it, what's it like being my filmer? What? Um, I don't know. Feels like I'm filming something for Dale. So it sucks. So like one of the ideas I had in the very beginning, I wanted to try to do a trick on all 18 holes. And I was like thinking about this hole and like how there's like nothing to it. But I realized that like, even though it's like that, that grass turf stuff, it's actually like easier to ride on than I thought. So I'm gonna try to do like, kind of like reverse manual tricks. Like I guess, it, do people call them anti-manuals? You don't know. He doesn't wanna be in the video, it's too cool for me. Fucking piece of well, shit. Well, he's in it. Cody Smith, everybody. At, what is your Instagram name now? Uh, Go is. follow him. So there's this hit, which looks so much better to skate than it actually is. It doesn't look crazy narrow, but it's actually like really hard to skate. Last time I came here with Dale though, uh, this is what we skated the most. And I just found out that my buddy Cody, who's filming the this pretty much all the skating side of this stuff, He's actually who ripped the carpet out, so kudos to Cody Smith for making this more skatable. But when we came here the other day, like the only thing I could do over it was like, I did like ollie boneless and I tried to kickflip and it was really scary. And then Haley came over on her own. She did like so many tricks first try. But uh, if you come to this spot, a guy just told us that he got kicked out by a cop yesterday. So I don't know if it's gonna be more of a bust now, but we skated it all day, like four days ago, and we skated it all day today to where like, like literally the sun's going down. So I'm posting this video probably three days after we filmed it. So it's probably still good if you see this video and you want to come skate it. No, nope. you're gonna blow the spot up. I literally don't care. <laughs> like I feel like everyone should be able to skate everything. It's California, there's so many spots and to go around. Except for the one spot by you that's definitely knobbed. That's yeah. not, not, there's a ledge spot by her that she it's says, knobbed. that she says is knobbed. No, it's knobbed, we're, we're ending the video. <laughs> and it's no. not knobbed, she just doesn't want anyone to, I'm not saying what spot it is. Okay. She just always says that it's knobbed when people ask about it. It's a really good ledge spot, but it's not knobbed. I honestly think that people should be able to skate whatever. I don't keep spot secret, unless it's like, someone gave me the, the pin to the spot and was like, hey, don't show anyone. Then I won't show anyone, but like if I find a spot, yeah, just like ask me, I'll, I'll probably tell you if I get around to seeing your DMs or if we are friends and just text me and I'll definitely just give you the spot. I don't really care about that side of things. Yeah. Oh my oh. God, are you trying to hit me? Yeah, I'm trying to shove it, sorry. So I thought I explored this place pretty good when we came last time, but evidently I didn't. There's like a whole other ditch up here. There's a gap over here. Down, like I literally only explored like eight of the 18 holes. This thing is sick. Like, like it's like it was built to skate. But look at this. That's like naturally like that. Did you wax it at all? No, but I just metal, so it's gonna grind. Oh! I guess I'm a liar. Ew, what is that thing? Ah. Almost did it. Oh, I've been filming all day. I'm tired. My name's Cody Smith. Follow me at Haley Isaac. Bruce <laughs> Nets. Oh! So I think we're done. Cody said that he has a camera like that we could use. There's a go kart track right there that has like a metal ledge and like a bump to ledge that people move around this metal bench thing. Um, but I'm honestly good. Like, there's enough spots here that I could actually definitely get more stuff, but I'm just tired. I, I suck at pacing myself. The same thing happened when I filmed something that hasn't come out yet. I filmed the video part in a day, and it was really in, I think, six hours because I just ran out of gas. Like, I was just super tired. This time I paced myself a little bit better. Tommy's Burger probably was not the move, but I got some stuff after Tommy's Burger, so it wasn't the worst. Oh 
this is the song where I make fun of artists, people like myself, Archito, and everyone else. So fucking important. Motherfucker, dance! Yo, this room goes to drugs, royalty, trends, and dogs, both for reefs, of who do you will worship? What's a lie in a speech by the well scripted preacher by faith with no mind deception? So resurrect us with no sign in his car, cause our affection is actually self god Monarchies will depend on the king to pretend, deities will be sent to pure existence. In love with this party Cause it's more than a qualified scene The songs we can dance to Have become a marketing scheme The two words have become the projects of Christ as disguise And it's labeled as art, officially free Everybody wants to be an artist Wants to start religions For the people sing their songs Everybody wants to be an artist, but